We are back! And I am personally here with my mommy, and it's just the two of us. Like, it should have always been. Like, I'm her favorite. <laughs> Rhonda and Larie, they just came, you know, but I'm her favorite. I am. Dawn, they just came. I was her favorite. Just wanted y'all to know. Yeah, just, just a little just a little hint of, of, of some stuff in the beginning and I'm just I'm just ecstatic because she's here you know this is the cooker so we've been there for years but they came home for the Thanksgiving home to eat and it was good and I think we're all about 10 pounds bigger but we feel good and I'm just I'm just happy right now so um, for, um, for the first time, a part. Yeah, of Kendall's um, Corner. Kendall's Corner. <laughs> ah, a name that I, along with my mom, gave her years ago with a store that we owned in the Crystal City area near Washington, D.C. It was called Kendall's Corner. I'm so lucky to have a mama like this. Y'all, okay, so everybody came up. So mama doesn't get on YouTube often. She is a very busy lady. Not at all. But I'm going to be sure that she gets up there today so she can see all of the well wishes that you all all gave to her when I put up her birthday video. Oh, my goodness. Thank you. Is she not beautiful? Thank you. Um, for her age, she always tries to say she's a year older than she's not. She's not. She's a She's still young at heart. Amen. But anyway, what I do want my mom to tell people about is that, as you all know, um, I am originally from Washington, D.C., but for a majority of my years, I grew up in Roanoke Rapids, North Carolina. And that is where pre presently my mom and my stepdad live. And my mom is a pastor there. So mom, will you tell them a little bit about, just in case y'all ever happen to come through Ronald Graphics, go on and stop by on Sunday and see my mom at about 10 o'clock. It is at 10 o'clock, and if you want a 100 word, uh, all we are, the, the name of the ministry is Colors of the Ministry. 30 years ago, God told me there's so many ways in which we share our ministries. My daughter's sharing hers through YouTube. There's so many ways that you're sharing yours. And so he said, just name it Colors of the Ministry. And so that it is. And uh, we're just a group of real people with real issues serving a real God and each other. And I think, uh, I think that... That makes it unique and special. I'm going to keep it 100 if you come to visit me because I've been there, done that. So I don't mind being able to share a little bit about me, my life, where I was, how I made it through, and how I plan to keep on going. Just stop by today on my way to heaven, and I know you're bound to go the same place. We just, we just, we just, we, we love the Lord, but we know that we're not too heavenly minded that we're no earthly good. See, because we got to be able to, we got to be able to talk and help people that are still on the earth, yeah. still living their thing. Without a doubt. Yeah. Um, Mom, give them the address. Be sure you give them the address. 1308 East 10th Street, Roanoke Graphics, North Carolina. We're there at 10 o'clock for worship service. Uh, each Sunday morning, we're there at 9 o'clock for our Sunday school on Wednesday evening at six o'clock. We have a heck of a Bible study where not just one person is talking. We let the Holy Spirit out of everybody speak. Uh, no big eyes and little U's in this place, though there is the shepherd and the sheep. And, uh, you know, and I have a shepherd above me as well, keeping me in line. And so um, I'm trying to think those are the dates and times we do have a Monday through Friday prayer a service at noon, uh, which you can get by our Colors of the Ministry 03 at gmail.com. Just straight through Colors of the Ministry 03 at gmail.com. You know, we had something the other night that was really interesting because oftentimes people won't necessarily... It, I guess because everybody's trying to do something within their own ministry. Mm -hmm. But God told me, he said, I want you to set up this uh, affair. And, and I, don't, I don't want it to be a C-O-M thing. Mm -hmm. I want it to be a W-O-G thing, a woman of God thing. 
and it was awesome. God, everything he said would happen, would happen. Can I share something of from course. that? Of course. I know y'all want to hear from my mama. <laughs> Just sit back and relax. Let me tell you something about being, first I share this with you. This is, this is who you are as well. A woman of God. Doesn't mean you're sitting up in somebody's church every Sunday. Doesn't mean you're so heavenly minded, you're no earthly good. It just means that you do know that there's a greater power, a greater source, and we gotta lock into it so that we can have joy. A merry heart doth the soul good. I, I, I wanted women of God, such as yourself, such as myself. Doesn't matter if, uh, if you have a corona uh, from now, on, uh, now or then, and we know that. <laughs> Doesn't matter if you have a glass of wine. You know, it does, what matters is if you lean and depend and know that Jesus came and died, was crucified, rose again, and sent us the Holy Spirit. So we don't go too far in anything because the Holy Spirit blocks us. Amen? Amen. So check this out. All of you that are women of God, and I know many of her friends that are women of God. Keep yourselves happy. Keep yourselves happy. And keep yourselves knowing this. You made it. Whether you're a private, a sergeant, a lieutenant, a captain, a major, or a colonel, you made it. Through the ranks, through the storms, through the abuses, through the rejections, through the hardships and unjust treatment, you made it. Through the failed relationships and yet raised the family. Mm, mm, mm. Many watched you, deny you, saying you should be silent, misunderstanding your mantle. You took your thoughts captive, making them obedient to Christ, controlled your emotions, not allowing them to control you anymore, controlled your tongue, your speaking edifies and empowers rather than tearing down. You're dressed in the armor of God's word, protecting your thoughts and your heart. You're girded with truth, shod with peace, carrying the sword of his word and the shield to extinguish the fiery darts of evil. Guess what? Lies no longer convince you because you found within you the depths of your real beauty. It is no longer external. Your affections are fixed on Christ Jesus, who is the head of your life. And you were created, thank you daughter, as a helpmate Yet many men still say, why women? They should be silent in the church. Well, today we say, why not women? Because if I could birth the word, I can surely raise it up. I can train it up and I can build it up. So speak now, my sisters. You are a gift, a tool, a warrior to be used in the army of the Lord. Just think about it. Think about it. Stay strong because that's who you really are. That's who you really are. And I want that to be dedicated. My mom is actually giving me this. But I want that to be dedicated to all my women, my wogs out there. God, you would have never stood forth, come forth on YouTube or any other tube had you not known all of these things that were expressed just then. So continue to do what you do. Continue to be empowered by it. Empower another woman along the way. And there's, not, there's nothing greater than you can do. 
I say happy Thanksgiving to each of you and to my crew, Colors of the Ministry, to my family uh, in New Jersey and in Delaware and Maryland and Florida and all over. And when you start naming names, you get in trouble, but don't charge it to the heart. Charge it to the head. I love you. And I thank you, baby, for yes. giving me an opportunity. I'm so happy to have my mommy on my channel. I hope, as I said earlier, all of you all had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I hope that you are able to spend it with the people that you love and oh that my you God, care yes, for yes. because that's what it is. I just means. thought Delaware, D.C., yes. families from way back, yes. way back, will, will never be anything but family. Yes. Love never fails. And I already told y'all, love is my religion. Amen. All right, well, y'all know what to do. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to your girl, go ahead and click that subscribe button. What you waiting on? And then once you click that, go ahead and set your notification bell to all so you can be notified every time this chick posts up. But until the next video, as I always say, be blessed. I sure am. I sure am.